Y'all, y'all just dropping cases. Y'all just gonna drop it. I guess you know who up next gonna come from. Well, y'all drop here. I'll drop mine. Oh, I can't leave. <laughs> I'll kill him like, hey, y'all, y'all drop a case. Let me give you a nine. Let me give you a nine. Drop a line. Drop a line. <laughs>
That is hard to walk away from, son. You need to get on your knees and thank God right now. Change your life. Change your life, boy. I'm telling you. Tupac ain't that had that many. So I guess what we're saying, he the real Tupac. He the gay Tupac. In the court documents, y'all just gonna do that? And you gonna let him lie to America? America gonna let that allow him to seal his record? I swear it don't. How you just gonna seal something? That was for us to, to gossip on. Now we ain't gonna know what really happened. I was nosy as the world trying to figure that out. What happened? Everybody, everybody in the courtroom like, ooh, ooh. And we out here like, So now, I guess all y'all, everybody, in a little part of me, gonna have to just get out here and say, you know what? Hmm, we're gonna have to come up with an apology. We're gonna have to come and apologize to Justin. So, dear Jesse, behalf of me and my viewers that thought you were guilty, <laughs> guilty. We would like to seriously, seriously apologize to you for bringing your own rope, your two Nigerian African friends to the forefront, and we thought you did something. We apologize. You know what? So let's just watch the video. Let's watch his apology. I just made a couple notes. Um, first of all, I want to thank my family, my friends, the incredible people of Chicago and all over the country and the world who have prayed for me, who have supported me, who have shown me so much love. No one will ever know how much that has meant to me, and I will forever be grateful. I want you to know that not for a moment was it in vain. I have been truthful and consistent on every single level since day one. I would not be my mother's son if I was capable of one drop of what I have been accused of. This has been an incredibly difficult time, honestly one of the worst of my entire life. But I am a man of faith and I am a man that has knowledge of my history and I would not bring my family, our lives or the movement through a fire like this. I just wouldn't. So I want to thank my legal counsel from the bottom of my heart and I would also like to thank the state of Illinois for attempting to do what's right. Now I'd like nothing more than to just get back to work and move on with my life. But make no mistakes, I will always continue to fight for the justice, equality, and betterment of marginalized people everywhere. So again, thank you for all the support. Thank you for faith and thank you to God. Bless y'all. Thank you very much. You can fight the adjustment, but they gonna fire you off the empire. Man, that boy just said, if he what, if he did it, then if he did that with any eyes of his mama's blood or something, he wasn't his mama's son. But ain't your mama then, boy, because you lied. <laughs> you done told a, you done told a whole heap of lies. And that, who wrote that for you? You done got my answer loaded like that stuff from you. Because it sounds believable. Well, there was a state of lies. You done got me hooked. <laughs> after, after what I just saw, that was lies. 